Hi everyone and welcome to High Valley Couponer and I'm in shock right now because I did some shopping today. This was some extreme couponing today. I feel like it was a haul like no other that I've ever done. This is just a great time doing couponing. Um, this is Walmart and all this is Kroger. It is on fire right now. Now, I do acknowledge not everyone can do the same deals. A lot of this stuff is a product of watching Kelsey B. Saves. Amazing, phenomenal series. I am, like, so amazed. She came up with this amazing idea. She took the time and contacted, like, 300 manufacturers. And every time she's um, got something in the mail, she's done a video and showed us what it was. And it was so, so amazing because it made me realize, and it makes all you realize, what companies are worth emailing and which aren't. And so, the, um... Yeah, and that's what she did. So, this is, and this amazing moneymaker is the Pop Chips, the Kodiak Cakes. All that stuff is a product of watching her videos and emailing the companies. If you've not done it, click my link in the description box, go to her channel, and binge watch that series. She's done five videos already, and I, I don't didn't think she said she was done. I think she still has some more that she's going to be doing. So, yeah, she has gotten so many coupons, and I've gotten them. Um, oh, the Bolt House. That was another one that came from her video. And she told me to share the deals that I find with her coupon, like the coupons. But I do want to give her credit, because that was just an amazing idea. And all these freebies were just sitting out there, and I never really knew about it. Like, I didn't... I've been my manufacturers in the past, but not, like, not to this level. And she has it so easy. She has it all broken down. Like, the links in the description box takes you directly to their contact page. And it's just phenomenal. So, check Kelsey's videos out. So, I had two bonuses. I needed 21 rebates to finish level four. And I thought, 21? No way. And some of you have even commented, yours is like five on 18, that it was just not worth it. However, if you do this, I got 21 rebates here. And this is all money makers. So, it might be worth it. So, here's again, I, that if you don't take the time to really calculate it out, and you just go in and pick up random stuff, that's not being smart. But get on Excel or write it on pen and paper. I've got a whole video that I'll have in the description box below talking about how I prep for these things. Because I don't just go in there and buy stuff. I, I, that'd be foolish. I plan it out and I know what it's going to cost me down to the penny. And it worked out even better today because of this. I knew there was no doubt in my mind it was going to go in there and pay like 70 cents for everything. But it wound up being a money maker because of those tortillas. But anyways, know what you're going to pay for everything in the end. That's the only way bonuses are worth it. But... Getting a table of this stuff for a moneymaker because of bonuses, that's worth it in my mind. So now y'all can't copy me to a T, but I just wanted to put these things out there. So $5 if I did three rebates is my other bonus, which would have been great. I could have just went in there and had some moneymaker, like a $2 moneymaker, but this pretty much was a $2 moneymaker when factoring everything in. So I'm happy with it. And I got things I need, and I like that. I love it when I get things I actually can use. So let's just do Walmart first. Okay, this one is a product of emailing the manufacturers that Kelsey's been telling us about. I emailed Chobani, and it took them five days or so for the coupons to get here. And they sent me a free Chobani flip or Greek yogurt. This wasn't a part of it. They sent, they sent her a free gimmies, though, I'm pretty sure. But they sent me one free Chobani flip and 50 cents off. Three 50 cents off of one coupons. So these are $1.22, so I grabbed these. $1.22... So that was free, and then I got 50 cents off the rest. And then I also threw in the Chibani Gimme's, which are $1.22 with a 50 cent I bought it, no coupon. But why I did all this is because Saving Star has a $1 back on five rebate. So let me give you some math here. So the Chibani yogurt and the Gimme's, these were like 95 cents or something for the five of them. That's not exact math. So it's like 95 cents for five cups. But in the bonus, it all worked out to be a moneymaker. And my grandma actually loves these things. So she likes the Yo Play ones better, but she likes these too. Okay, and then the So Delicious yogurt. This is $1.58. I had more of those one-off one printables. Hopefully you got some. I'll have those in the description box below where I got it from. This came from couponing with Alsande. Awesome. Um, so these were a moneymaker. 58 cents out of pocket, 75 cents I bought them. What else do we got? Okay, the Johnsons. This one is, uh, I can't even believe it. So, the powder and the bars, they all worked. These are $1.92 each at Walmart. So, here, this is a little confusing. The Johnsons coupons are really annoying, and they read limit one identical coupon and limit four 
of any Johnson's coupon in a transaction. So here, I had a three off of two Blinky from Kroger. So there we go. I had a 250 off of two printable and had a one off of one printable. So that's great. That made these 42, what did that make? I got the math. I got it all on my computer trying to be good here. So 380 out of pocket for all five. Ibotta has a dollar back on each of them with a limit of five. So you get back five dollars. You are going to have a dollar twenty money maker on your hands for the five of those with tax. Everything I give includes Ohio 7.25 sales tax. You know, you'll have to go and back out that. My sales tax was 70 cents, so it would have actually been a dollar a dollar ninety money maker. But I count taxes. Tax is legit. That's a real cost. You can't get around it. Splenda Zero with Stevia. This is a really great deal. I got this one from um, Stephanie. These are $3.97. I had a dollar off printable. She said she had a dollar fifty coupon. My dollar fifty coupon didn't work on this. Um, it was only for the Splenda Naturals. But I had a dollar off printable, which I'll have in the description box below. So I paid $2.97. I bought it, gave me back $2, making it $0.97, cents, which is just awesome. I'm really happy. The Star Wafers, the printable reset, these are $1.62 or $1.63. Had $2 off printable. So it was a money maker. It said limit one per trip. So I did it. Um, did two transactions to get two of those. I don't know if that's right or not. If you think that's wrong, I'm sorry. I didn't do it the same transaction. So I think transaction and trip are the same. I, I don't know. The GE light bulbs, these are $1.24. There's a dollar I bought. I got this one from Shay a couple weeks ago. It's just been resetting over and over. So 24 cents. The Bull House Farms. Here's another one. Um, thank you again to Kelsey. Um, these are $1.96. Now, the Ibotta says Bull House B, but it's like the same one in the picture um, on there. It's Strawberry Banana, and I scanned it, and it said it qualified. So, I think they just changed the packaging. But these are $1.94. Had a one-off of one mailer from contacting Bull House. They sent me five of those. So, I paid $0.94. Cents. I got $0.50 cents from Ibotta, so really great. The money makers are coming. Here's, a, here's the first one. Preparation H. This is an awesome one. These are $3.40, what was it? $3.48. I had a $2 printable. That's on Retail Me Not, or no, it's still Red Plum. That's weird. And then $2 Saving Star. So phenomenal moneymaker. All this will be in the printable breakdown. Hostess Cupcakes. These look amazing. I remember these from like my childhood, and I was like, I'm gonna get these again, because these used to be like so good. They are a dollar at Walmart. Had a, these are a little end cap over by, in between the registers at the front. Had a horrible time finding them. They sell them at Kroger as well, but Walmart's easier. Self-checkout's easier there than Kroger. Kroger, I had two free coupons, and this one caused the drama, so I just, I'd rather use them at Walmart. They're one dollar. Had a one dollar free product coupon, so totally free. Shea Moisture Wipes. This is amazing. I love this deal so much. These are $5.44, had a $3 coupon, and a $2.05 I bought it, so like $0.40. Cents. Um, Polygrip, this isn't that great. This is $4.78, had a $1.50 off mailer, and I had a $2 I bought it, so like $1.20. That actually is amazing. Okay, the Red Vines are $1.24. I had a no coupon, which I really ought to write them for coupons, because as much as we buy those things, I really ought to ask for coupons. 124 and I had a 50 or 45 cent I bought us. That was just an awesome one. Okay, the act. This is an awesome one. Who gave me this deal on the act? Was it me? Maybe I came up with this the other night. I don't know. Someone said it. Um, okay, the act kits. Yeah, I think I did. It was like last Wednesday. I think I saw this. Three dollars and 47 cents. I had a one dollar coupon. There's a one dollar I bought it, and there's a one dollar savings. Starts so at 47 cents. The deal, I think this is like a penny cheaper, the Act um, Adult, same deal. That's great. Okay, the Kodiak Cakes. Now, this is another one that Kelsey did. This is like one of her first, one of her first videos. This is the first one I remember writing besides Shirt Deodorant, which never answered back. Um, the Kodiak Cakes. They sent me two free product coupons. The best place that I know to use them is Walmart. Um, Kroger might have these as well. The protein packed muffin mix this is four dollars and 48 cents or something and i have the free product coupon but i bought it has 50 cents back on the big muffin mix so 50 cent money maker and these little microwavable muffins the same these are a dollar fifty dollar fifty coupon so free and there's a 50 cent i bought it so 50 cent money maker on the kodiak cakes 
go ahead and email them. I, the worst they could do is not give it to you, but they gave it to me, so I don't know why they wouldn't give it to you. Okay, the crushed grape. This is $1.08. I had a 50 cent Ibotta and a 25 cent any soda. This deal came from Melanie. So awesome deal. That's I don't I want a diet crush from my great uncle, but they didn't have it at Walmart, so whatever. The good crisps. These are this is a this is not the best deal ever, but I just really like these things. And it, again, getting things that I want for free in the bonus is worth it. $2.83. I had a dollar fifty no, a fifty cent I bought it at a one dollar bonus. So amazing. Um, the Canyon House Bagels. This is $4.98. I had a one-off one printable. These are in the gluten-free area. And there's a $3 I bought. A scan just fine. So these are 98 cents. And that's, whether you're gluten-free or not, that's a great price. Okay, so there's a couple other Walmart deals that I didn't do because it just didn't work at my bonus. My store, I would have done the Dove Promises. My store doesn't have it because my store does not have much. It's 78 cents and there's a 39 cent I bought it. Marvetta shared that. Airwick was from Carrie and Renee. They are 488 for the Freshmatic refills. There is a buy one get one coupon from yesterday's insert. So you pay 488 for two plus tax. I bought it has two dollars back, so it would be with a lemon to two, I believe. So you end up getting those for 44 cents a piece, which is awesome. We've done it. I don't have that Airwick Freshmatic thing, so I didn't do it, and it just didn't work out in the deal. But if I had one, I definitely would do that. Whether you're doing a bonus or not, that's just cheap. Um, Kaylee Parrot found some Nuke baby items for 50 cents, actually, and there was a $2 Ibotta. I didn't see anything like that. Um, Wanda said she found some Shea Moisture hair products on clearance at Walmart. I didn't see any of that stuff. And then, um, a couple people told me about the Right Guard. Um, couponing with Alsande, I know, was one of them. But it's $1.98 for the Right Guard Sport, which dollar I bought. I didn't end up getting that today because I got all these things. I didn't need anything else. But if I would have needed a filler, that would have been a good one. Okay, so I didn't get as much at Kroger, but I really did do good there as well. The Kellogg's Fruit Snacks are 99 cents, the 25 cent I bought up. The Mojo's. Now, my mom just was, she was getting the Horizon Chocolate Milk. She just really likes that stuff, and it's not too bad for a breakfast, I guess. It's kind of pricey, but whatever. They're 88 cents and you buy eight. Well, the Cliff Mojo's are a part of that, so I took advantage of her getting those um, chocolate milks and threw these in. So these were only 88 cents now, and I got two dollars back on two from my bottle. So a little money maker there. If you're just buying them, they'd just be a dollar, which would still make them free, which is great. The ones about a farm. Now these are two bucks. I had a dollar digital on a different Kroger card. I told you I've explained that over and over why there's multiple cards, and I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get into it again. But so I paid a dollar, got 50 cents on my bottle, and I actually got a 50 cent bonus for buying, for doing this deal twice on my bottle. So this is free. Pop Chips, I had a free product coupon. Kelsey um, shared that one. So that was just free. There isn't a bottle rebate if you do that in the bay. And I originally was going to do that, but I picked up the wrong bay and had to return it. And the other one was just too pricey. So we just didn't do that. And then the Cremette. These are a dollar this week. There's a 25 cent five times coupon. So 75 cents. And I bought it has a dollar on two. And then the La Tortilla Factory. This was like the best deal of the day. These organic tortillas are $3.99. I had a free product coupon that Kelsey shared. Now, I actually DM'd her on Instagram because I couldn't remember. Okay, so I was at my Kroger. They scanned the coupon, and it says exceeds item value, need manager's approval. And this doesn't usually, I don't know, need the manager's ID. Well, the cashier read it and read it and read it and verified it was legit, looked at the letter they sent me to prove it was legit. Always bring your letters with you so that if they want to look at them, they can see you're not some fake counterfeit coupon person. So they read it. And they entered the ID and it automatically took off $5.99. These were only $3.99. So since it took off the extra two dollars, I said, oh, those were only $3.99. And she just said, oh, it's okay. And just like, that was it. That's, that's what happened. So I got $2 overage on these tortillas, which was insanity. That was awesome. So that is Kroger. Let's now talk about the math. Let me go do some quick calculations because I realized I had to change a few things. Okay, so I apologize if that's hard to see. Retail for all this stuff was $86.10. After coupons are applied, it was $42.91. After I got back all those rebates, it was $5.10. And then I got back $5 for the blast off bonus and $2 for level four. So for all these items, which is a grand total, how many items was this? It was like 
I got 36 items. It was a $1.90 moneymaker for all this stuff. I made $1.90 to take all this home. That is just unheard of. So yeah, what a haul. I really, really enjoyed it. Great way to end April with a bang. Best haul ever. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments.